all right y'all this water guy tv man we back with another video you know how we do so check kevin hart right he just filed a lawsuit on tasha k the youtuber right so for extortion so we all know that in this industry for some reason people like to put interviews out of them talking about other people right and it gets a lot of a lot of people view it okay they like to hear about what's going on with these celebrities not thinking that they're regular people but some of these people want to gain financial prosperity by having information on you and this is what we seeing with tasha k okay well this happens all over lawyers whatever anybody that got something on you and they know you got some money they're gonna try to say that they're gonna expose you and pay me, right? But I don't think you should never pay them because if you decide that you're gonna pay them, they just gonna keep really trying to drain your pockets. So Kevin Hart, let's get into this, right? Kevin Hart, right? Uh, he's suing uh, Tasha K for extortion. So Tasha K tried to get him to pay her a quarter million dollars according to court documents uh so she won't put out an interview that he had with an ex-assistant that he had you know dealings with all right so kevin hart actually speaks about this and says hey you know he takes responsibility he says you know with a lot of with being a celebrity comes with a lot of pluses but also comes with his negatives which is you always on the spotlight right so Tasha K shared a, a, a teaser for the interview uh, on December 22nd on a live stream. So, you know, she's trying to make the fans get into it. But per the lawsuit, Hart sent Kebby a cease and desist letter. It was also started that Shakes, who worked for Hart from 2017 to 2020, had also signed a non-disclosure agreement and confident confidentiality agreement. So as y'all see, these pe these women or the lady uh, who's talking about Mrs. Shakes already got paid. She's just, you know, trying to get more money. You know, Tasha K paying her to talk about it, all of that. You know, it probably was, Tasha K was probably into it. She probably told Tasha K like I'm not really supposed to speak on this so maybe you can hold an interview and try to get some money from, from Kevin Hart because I, you know you can't even put this out so this is the game you're going to go through when you're in uh, the western culture every do whatever to get a buck up to get a buck out you and this is what we got to take situations like this and understand that we can't put ourselves in situations to where this can, you know, hurt us or knock us. Because a lot of guys have lost their careers, have, you know, off of false accusations or people that's just trying to gain money and clout to expose you. So we got to pay attention to now today's day and when we hear information on people trying to expose people because they could be lying and just trying to get money or trying to blackmail or trying to extort that's where the money's at okay because you got to sue somebody to get that you can't just it's not a jail crime for that so it's like it's 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 it's, it's fair game so let me know what y'all think about uh kevin hart man it, do you think he should get any public backlash for this even if what the ex assistant is saying is true. She signed a disclosure that she wouldn't talk about it. Tasha K trying to get a quarter million. She trying to pay off Cardi B from her getting sued from somebody else. It's just a whole mess here, all right? But let me know what y'all think in the comment section, man. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace, love. Are you ready for cleaner, safer water throughout your entire home? Our high efficiency water systems handles just that. Plus, it can be installed in one day by our expert local installers.
Just click below to check local pricing and claim your free water test today.